begin with breaking news from Detroit right now. Firefighters on the scene of this massive fire. 7 Action News reporter Brianne Palmerini is live on the scene with what she's learning tonight. Brianne, how bad is that fire at this point? Well, it is still rolling. It is still very much on fire here. It started about an hour ago. You can see the smoke from miles around. If you're driving in the area here, you'll definitely see that smoke. It is the fire that we are standing on the scene of right now. I'm talking to neighbors. They are eyewitnesses. They saw the whole thing happen. They lived in the house right next door to this fire and their home now, sadly, also burning up and completely destroyed right now. You guys, this is Marvin. This is Perry. You guys saw the whole thing happen. Your neighbor was transported. What's his condition right now that you saw? Third degree burns everywhere, all over his body. His hair burned. Face, arms, chest, back, everything. It was like he had to be, I thought when it happened, he had to be like right there when it happened because it was so crazy that when he came out the house, he was still sitting on the porch while it was burning, right there next to the window that was burning and everything. He wouldn't even move. Wow, and you guys, you said you heard the explosion and then you just had to run? We ran. Yeah, the we first ran. Time, the first explosion, it happened. We looked and seen what it happened, what it was. We seen bricks flying. The second time it happened, glass and bricks got to coming through the side door in the kitchen and everything. That's when we ran down the hallway to the back of the house. Jumped out the window. Jumped out the window. Yeah, so you guys were really lucky that you got out when you did. The bricks were flying. Their neighbor taken to the hospital tonight. We do know that he was the only person living in that home. And all of uh, Marvin and Perry here, they got out safely. Everyone in their home got out safely. But again, their home on fire right now. And of course, we're watching the situation. As it is happening, firefighters still working very, very hard to put this fire out. And we'll continue to have updates for you as they become available. Live, I'm Brianne Pomerini, 7 Action News. Brianne, let me ask you one quick question if you can still hear sure. me. That fire has jumped to a home next door, or is it just one home on fire? Two homes. It jumped to the home next door. With Marvin and Perry's home is also on fire right now. They were able to make it out safely, but one home, that's where they heard the explosion, and now the second home is on fire as well gotcha. as firefighters work to put them both out. Now, All often right, in, in situations like this, Brianne, they have water uh, pressure problems on some of these neighborhoods. Any indication that's happening there tonight? I'm not sure right now the water pressure issues at this point right now. Yeah, they're pouring water on us. See if it's enough to, to keep them going to another house. All right, thanks, Brianne.